I give a vote to a woman. She's got better things to do with her cross. She's been ruling from her back for 10,000 years, and she doesn't want a brand new boss. For the new one might be difficult to manage, and you cannot get a man into a marriage unless you make him a king. So soft voice slaves, you rule the waves already. So why spoil a damn good thing? has discharged his creative impetus. I can't read! How can I understand you? Shut up and grow up. Uh, thank you for your song, gosh. Uh, don't go slashing too many pictures. One day you may destroy a good one by accident. Ha, ha, and, uh, ha. Uh, in a moment, Miss Gosh will sound off a serious blast on behalf of the women... Get on with it! The, the women's suffrage movement. Yes, uh, the women's suffrage movement. Give her the vote! Oh, do sit down. Of course, we had hoped to follow this by having a quick sketch by Pablo Picasso. Never heard of him. However, it being Monday, he's having his drawing. You're lucky. I'm here to replace him. Poem by the new genius of the planet Earth. Concrete by Henri Godier Breschka. Play the Maestro's March. My assistant, Miss uh, Gosh. Gosh Boyle. Miss Gosh Boyle. Take your clothes off or we're sunk. One, two. Her tits are made of concrete, her soul is made of jam. Tomato soup flows from her nose, she's the dream of the family man. Bring me a cup of paraffin or an old sock soaked in scotch to touch my concrete Venus with the all electric watch. That's it. <laughs> I've just thought of a much dirtier song. Oh, no, don't worry about them. I know something much better we can do. What? Blow up the Royal Academy of Art! Eh? Hey, <laughs> Lord, don't come 